as we're all here as Christians today, when in conflict, are we willing to choose our witness over the win? Are we willing to lose to make sure that we put the right witness into the public square? And too many times, and I think we've seen this recently, too many times Christians have chosen to win over having the right witness. And to me, I think that's just misplaced faith. Are we putting our faith in an election? Are we putting our faith in a policy outcome? Or is there something bigger that's ultimate that we really lean on? And what does it say to other people when we're willing to lose to make sure that we maintain our principles? That we're not willing to revise our principles on each election to make sure that it fits what we want to do at that time. That we're willing to stand by what we believe even if it means we lose three election cycles in a row. Again, nobody wants to do that. But it's a matter of faith if we're willing to do that in a situation where these are very serious issues. And so I think Christians had to, I started to think that Christians had to come to a place where we were able to say what our principles were and we would be able to come together because the truth of the matter is a lot of what's the, what divides us is ideology. A lot of what divides us is, is partisanship. It's not Christian principles. We have an agreement on Christian principles, but what we don't understand sometimes is in the, in the political, political um, space, there are, there are people that don't want African-American Christians who may have more uh, culturally conservative values but be Democrats or white evangelicals who may be Republicans, there's a lot of people who don't want us to come together to have a conversation. They want to be able to interpret what the other is saying for us, that we don't have those conversations together.